Hello everyone and welcome back to Sarion. And we are here with Hura who is uh, currently a sub-adult and uh, actually not seeing much food so that's not so good. Um, there's something over here but I think that might be a Gila monster so yeah not such a good thing where the Palea... I can't remember the names you guys I'm sorry. I looked them up last time. No that is a lizard. Okay. Um, I went and looked them up last time. These guys are shamops. That's, that at least I know. Um, and we got them. Oh my goodness, just one bite, too. They don't even satisfy that much hunger anymore. Um, oh, there's something over here. Okay. And it is... It's more packies, and I see a croc. So, I, I... Croc or an alligator, I'm actually not sure which. Um, it's either the boreal or the brachio... Sucus. Okay. Oh my. Oh, nope, 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 nope. He's running straight at us. Oh, no, 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 no. Please don't. Ow. Dude. I was leaving. Okay, you know what? For that, for that, for that, I am going to feed you to the alligator. Dude. Dude. You're a jerk. Yeah, no. You're, you're rude. You're rude. Is he still coming after us? No, I wanted to get over there. I just wanted to cross. I just wanted to cross. Okay, I'll cross over here. I'm gonna feed all of you to the croc. <laughs> um, don't see anything through here. There we go. So I think that's a... Is that a boreal sucus or a brachio sucus? Or a brachio... Okay, something... I can't even remember the names now. One of them's like boreal something... All right, hey, come here. Hey. Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna get attacked if you do that. All right, somebody's gonna go down. Whoa, are they still locked onto me? I don't know if they're, I think, why are they still attacking me? They should be attacking the croc, right? Man, these guys are not smart. Dude, no. Excuse me. Alright, oh, this is bad. I'm gonna go this way. Oh, there. Hey, hey. I'm gonna lay down. I'm not gonna lay down because you are gonna kill me. Please stop. Please stop. Go fight. Go fight. Yeah, go get. I. Dude, these guys are annoying. I really don't like them. Alright. I'm gonna watch that one. What the heck? Why? No. Excuse me. I just want to be left alone. Hey! Hey! I am leaving! Get away, you jerk! <laughs> you are a jerk. Alright, why... Why won't it let me run, either? It won't let me run. There we go. Now I can run. I guess I was just too low. Hey, there's a trike over there. Dude, okay, if you... If you try and attack me... Oh my... Okay, where... Where is it? Where is one... I need... Okay, I need something... Something bitey. I need something that will bite him. All right, let's go this way. I'm going that- there's a biter. Okay, there we go. Yeah, you're sunning yourself, right? Okay. You know what? No, I'm- I've had enough of your nonsense. Hey, hey you. Get over here. Come get me. Yeah, there we go. You guys are so mean. Get your butt over here. Get attacked by the crocs. I'm gonna get a drink of water, too, because I'm thirsty. Is he running up to attack? Oh, no, he's running up to eat. Hey. 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 Come here. Oh, he's getting attacked now. Good. Okay. Good, good. Wait, what? Oh, he's gonna fight. Okay. There we go. Now I can Now I can run. For some reason, it seemed like my run is glitching out. Oh, yeah, he's going down. Oh, he's going down. He's got two of them. Hey, you. Hey. I wonder if we could get that Triceratops then to kill 
to kill the crocs. Dude, they're gonna take him down. Oh, he's on the run. Oh, we should be able to get him then. Are they fighting each other? Dude, this is insane. There's like a straight up croc brawl going on here. Oh, and then he's gonna eat him. That's that's fine. Hey, are you are you weak? You're weak. All right, you're weakened. You're weakened. Yes, that means you are prey. All right, we got him. We got him once, but we didn't actually get to jump bite him. All right, let's run this way and steer him. Steer him away. Steer him this way. Hey, hey, you. All right. I don't want him uh, getting too close to the salt water. I'd like him to go this way if possible. All right, we gotta let our own stamina recharge a little bit, but we're gonna keep following him for sure. And we're gonna try and take him down the way we did the first one that one time. All right, let's chase this guy down. And I don't want him to get too strong again, but I think he took quite a lot of damage there. All right, we gotta flap our wings. Or I guess they're not wings, they're arms, but... They look like wings. <laughs> They're arms. We just gotta flap them. They have feathers here. Um. Alright. And we can do it again. Oh, yes. Oh, that was nice. There we go. And we're away from the water, so hopefully it won't drain our, uh, our thirst. Because that looks like salt water right there. And we took him down. Because these guys are jerks. They're bullies. <laughs> no, they're just actually really territorial. That's what animals do. But you know what? No, I, we're taking you down. If that's You're not going to do that on my territory. Um, if you do that on my territory, I, I will take you down. <laughs> Even if it means feeding you to, to a croc first to do it. Uh, so anyway, that was kind of a chaotic beginning to the episode. That, this is, yeah, that's bad water. Okay, that's salt water. Um, is this water? This is fresh water. Okay. There is something swimming right there, too. Um, I'm not sure which it is. I can't see which kind, but it's either one of the crocs or one of the alligators. Alright, we're gonna get our water there. Let's head back. I kind of want to see what happens with this, uh, this triceratops here. Actually, I want to see what happens if we get this guy. What is, first of all, is this guy gonna be mad at us? He doesn't care. He just really doesn't care. Okay. We should be able to lose him pretty easily in the swamp, too, if we need to. Because he's big and bulky and we're small and maneuverable. So, I don't foresee us having an issue. He is coming this way, though. Kind of pretty, honestly. Um, Chorus took a few of those down back in the day. And so we'll definitely have to try that again with Hura sometime, but maybe not right away. That does tend to be pretty challenging and pretty time-consuming, and it's a lot of trial and error to get the conditions just right. But, um, it would be interesting. Oh, here's one of these little raptor guys. Hey, you think you're gonna be on our turf? You think you're gonna be on our turf? You're not gonna be on our turf. You're going down. And did we get him? We didn't get him. There we go, we got him. All right. You are not welcome on our turf. We're going to defend our territory. And that croc is still uh, still sunning himself next to the other one that he killed. Oh, there's two of them. Look at them. Look at them sunning themselves. Hmm. What happens if we bite you in the tail? Are you going to snap at us? What if I bite your tail? What if I bite your tail? What if I bite you? Hey. Hey, I'm going to bite you. I'm going to bite your butt. I'm going to bite you in the tail gonna bite you. Okay, I guess I'm not gonna bite you. <laughs> um, hey, are you, are you, are you angry? What if I rush you? What if I rush you like that? Hey. Oh, he, he's trying to threat display us. He's trying it. All right, we're gonna, I'm, I'm trying to provoke this guy because I want to have him run over those, I want to have him run over those guys over there. No. I'm not backing down. This is my territory. This is my territory. Stop stop threat displaying. What if I bite him in the tail? Alright, we're gonna try this. And I missed. Okay. <laughs> um, I'm gonna bite him in the tail. Okay, bite him. Bite him, bite him. Oh, oh, run. Oh, run. Okay, now we run. Now we run. And we run. Oh, he's coming this way. I'm gonna run past these guys, because I want to see if he'll hurt them or if they'll hurt him. Okay, we gotta get him centered. Is he gonna trample them? 
Oh, he's coming real fast. Okay, we gotta get out of here. I think I think I made a mistake. Uh, mistakes have been made. All right, we gotta get away. He's still after us. He's still after us. I should not have done that. Um, I thought he was gonna end up with the Crocs there. I thought they were gonna take him on or something. But nope, that was not how this worked out. All right, we gotta rest. I'm gonna actually lay down a little bit and that'll regain our stamina faster because then we can get away faster. Um, yeah, I didn't think it was gonna be that big of an issue. Run, please. There we go. Yeah, I didn't think he was gonna get that angry. I thought we could feed him to a croc. <laughs> oh, that was a mistake. That was actually a mistake. All right, there's some crocs up here. There's also another Dakota Raptor. Is he still angry? He's still angry. Yeah, he's still angry. Okay, there's another one right there. We're going this way. I'm gonna rest right here for a moment and just regain some stamina. I think we're being evicted. We might be being evicted. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, go, 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 go. We might be being evicted from this area by an angry Triceratops. Um, well, that's fun. All right, we're going this way. I'm watching to see. All right, there's something over there of interest, but I, I don't know what it is. Is he still after us? I'm gonna rest. I think we might have lost him. Did we lose him? I think we lost him. Yeah, he's back there. Yeah, we're good. He's still, I think he's still angry. But I think we'll go ahead and sleep through, uh, I think we'll go ahead and sleep through the night here. Um, well, we now know that the, the, the crocs and the alligators won't do anything about triceratops. They, they know not to mess with them, and probably for good reason. So, yeah. Oh, and this is now the middle of the night. Great. All right. And our stats are down again. Um, is there still an angry, angry guy over here? We're not going to be able to see him very easily in the dark either is the thing. If he's still over here and still angry, he could kind of sneak up on us a little bit. I'm just not entirely sure where he went. He might have de completely despawned, actually. I think that might happen when you time skip like that. I'm trying to see if there's anything dangerous that's going to leap out of this water at me if I go to get a drink. All right, we're going to get our water up in any case. And I think we need to find something to eat. But I don't know what there would be. Hmm... Hmm. I think the carcasses will have despawned by now, too. Probably. This is where this is where a lot of them were, I think. There's little birds along the shore there. Maybe we'll be able to get some of them. And morning is coming as well, so that's good. Alright, let's see if we can uh if we can sneak up on any of these guys. There's some crocs in the water. I call them all crocs because it's hard to tell which one is which, um, unless you can see them. Really? Really? That was really dumb. Alright, you bite, bite, bite. There we go. Got him. Alright, that's hardly even a morsel now for us, though. Um, we need to find more substantial food and pretty fast. Alright, we got a little bird. And that helps satiate our hunger a little bit. There's another one. Maybe if we find enough of them, we could fill our hunger up. Actually, yeah, that did get our hunger up. All right. Oh, nope, he's running. All right. Or he's flying. Is he going to land somewhere? He is going to land right here. And... Oh, nom, 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 nom. There we go. We, no. This one is just tricky. What's that? There's something over there that smells yellow. That... It's another raptor. Ooh, that's something we definitely want to check out. Because if it's another Dakota raptor, we're either going to need to fight for the territory or we're going to need to leave the territory, um, depending on which it is. It looks like it is another Dakota. That much I think it is. But I'm not sure what kind. And is this... 
a lizard that is, or the Shemops, I think they're called. Is that a younger one? No, it's, oh, it's one of the, is it one of those little black raptor guys? I think so. No, it is one of us, okay. It is, isn't it? I can't tell very well, actually. Um, I think that is... Um, no, it's one of those little black guy, black raptor guys. There we go. Got him. Nope. Uh, there we go. Got him. Holy nope! Oh my gosh, what in the what just happened? Oh, please don't tell me he's chasing. Why is he still chasing me? Nope, nope, nope. This is not what I signed up for. This is not what I signed up for. <laughs> Gonna have a flippin' heart attack. Oh, there's two of them. Okay. I'm pretty sure that this is a sign that it is time to leave. We are being evicted from our marshes. How old are we now? We're almost age six, and I think age seven is when we're going to officially grow up. So, we're getting out of here, and we're gonna make our way across the marsh and uh, do the best we can to escape to the sea. And then I think we're going to try and find a nice river to reside along because this area has been taken over by T-Rexes and they want to eat us. So, yeah, that's that's not... No, we're not getting... Not today. Not today. We're not getting eaten by T-Rexes today. Um, oh, and I am out of stamina. So we need to keep it moving that was terrifying. That is one of the most traumatic experiences I've had in a game in a long time. <laughs> that was a little bit, uh, a little bit scary. Um, oh, and we can, okay, let's, let's actually do that. Let's go ahead and advance to the next growth stage real fast while we can. So we'll go ahead and press C to sleep and that will let us advance to the next growth stage. And... Are we an adult? Boom! We're an adult! Hera has grown up, and she's still pretty hungry, still fairly thirsty. We need to find somewhere to get food and water pretty soon, um, but I don't think it's going to be this marsh, because we're now in the saltwater part of the marsh, and the freshwater part has been taken over by a pair of T-Rexes, and we're not gonna, not gonna mess with that nonsense. No siree. We're going to head off and find our own way. So we have to find a river pretty quickly here because otherwise we're going to be in some trouble. But for now, I think we are going to, to head this way. That is, okay, we're going to avoid you because you are trouble. And we're going to go this way. All right, made it across. All right, let's rest a little bit. Walk nice and slow. We could really use some food as well. I think now that we're an adult, though, we're going to have a lot more food and water. And so we won't have to be as concerned about that. So let's see. I think we're going to be more okay now that we're more um, an actual adult. So I think, oh, and here's some food if we can actually catch it, which I think we did. Did we catch it? Um, did we? I think it might have left that or it just did like nothing. It wasn't even really worth chasing down. All right. The beach is right up. Whoa. I didn't expect to vault that far. The beach is right up here. I think we're going to follow it and uh, try and see if we can find an inlet somewhere where there will be a river that will go freshwater because uh, our, our old home has been taken over by T-Rexes. And that's not a good thing. All right, we're going to avoid the uh, paleo, is it a paleos one or something or another? The, the Gila monster. We're going to avoid the Gila monster. <laughs> um, all right, we're going to keep it moving along here. I'm going to keep using my scent. And I think, I hope that T-Rex had just spawned too, because if I ran straight up to a T-Rex without seeing it, I am never going to hear the end of it because you guys don't ever let me forget my mistakes. <laughs> oh, yeah. You guys don't let me forget when I make an oops. 
So we're going to just keep following the shore here, I think. And there should be another river. There tends to be a lot of them along here. If you just go far enough. Um, the trouble is we need to find some food and water as well. And so we don't have a lot of time to get to a river. And we're going to have to try and find something a little bit more difficult to hunt, I think. Otherwise, we're going to be in a little bit of trouble. And that's not going to be a good thing. Uh, we definitely need to be pretty, pretty careful. So I think if we keep heading this way, we should be okay, right? Um, I'm not going to just like run up to the edge of the world and have nowhere to go, am I? I think we're still we're still good. We have half water. We only had we've only used like a quarter of our water. We didn't actually um use up all that much. So I don't think we're going to have too many problems. But I think we do still need to be kind of careful. Um if we could find a river along here. Oh, there's a river. I think I see one. That or the sea curves and I hope it's not that. But I see trees on the other side, so I don't think the sea just curves up there. I think that is actually a river, so that'll be good. Let's just get over there and get ourselves a little bit situated and maybe try and find something to eat. There's something here. There's one of those Gila monster things. But I don't really want to mess with those yet because I don't feel like getting poisoned and I don't feel like dying. And, uh, yeah, I'd rather not do that. So... Rather not die today, if possible. Let's keep uh, let's keep going this way. I don't want to evade a T Rex and then die to a Gila monster. Um, that's not a river, is it? Nope, that's not a river. Okay, we got to go the other way. And there is a Pachycephalosaurus there. Those will probably end up becoming our primary food source, won't they? Um, yeah. So this could be kind of bad. I just want to run ourselves over this way a little bit more. If we can, we'll go this way a bit. And see if we can... We'll just have to keep sprinting and then resting, I think. See if we can get a little bit further this way. Because there's got to be a river somewhere. I just don't know exactly where. We might have to just go back to the swamps, you guys. We would have the energy for that, at, the, at least. I just don't want to do that because there's T-Rexes, and T-Rexes are not nice. Um, so we're going to keep it moving this way a little bit, and then we're probably going to wrap up pretty soon. Yeah, we definitely don't have a lot of time, and we don't have a lot of, uh, we don't have a lot of places we can go. I think we're going to end up getting driven back. Food! I see food! Hey, you! You are, you are going to be a snack for me. There we go. We're going to eat. And uh, I don't think we'll probably actually sleep at the, what? That's the, that's the Gila monster. Okay. That's what I heard. I just heard a hiss and that scared me quite a lot. Um, but we're going to head this way. I hope we'll be able to actually find our way back to the swamp. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah, I think we'll be all right. Let's just run back if we can. And I think we'll probably have to just brave the T-Rexes if we can because we need water, but we probably won't stop. We'll probably keep moving once we get water and try and find someplace else to stay that'll be a little bit less, uh, less full of T-Rexes. Oh, here's some more food, too. But I don't really want to deal with him right now. He is going to run away from us, for sure. All right, let's go this way. We're going to get across. I'm not going to deal with him while he's in the water like that, because I don't want to have to worry about accidentally ingesting salt water, which does seem to be a problem when you kill something near salt water. And so we're going to keep it moving this way. What did I hear? I think it was just probably one of the crocodiles or alligators or something. But we're going to keep going until we find a freshwater part, we'll get something to drink, and then we'll settle down and end off the episode there because we do need to get some water pretty quickly. And I think we'll be able to find it now that we're back to the swamp. But we kind of just tend to keep getting stuck here in the swamp, and that's not something I want to see continue. So we definitely need to move on pretty soon. The swamp has been really good to us when it comes to growing up. But, now that we're an adult, we need to start finding and staking our own territory, maybe a little bit farther away. We, we've got to find, we've got to find a new home. 
and uh, especially one that's probably going to be a little less prone to having T-Rexes spawn in it. Uh, let's keep moving this way, and I think we'll see probably some more water over here somewhere that's going to be a little bit nicer and a little bit better and not full of salt. Um, so I think we probably, actually I think we got to head this way to get into the, the deeper swamp because I don't see a lot of those trees this way. I think we're seeing most of them over here. There's the freshwater swamp. All right, I think this is probably fresh water here, um, and I don't actually see the T-Rexes. This is fresh water, right? Right? I can't tell if it's fresh water. I can't tell if it's fresh water, you guys. It's salt water, of course it's salt water. Okay, we gotta keep it moving back then. Um, back here, is it fresh water? This looks more like fresh water. Please? No! Oh my gosh, if we die of thirst right now, I will be really upset. Alright. Where is the freshwater swamp? There, what, It goes further back. Now I'm completely lost, and we have, like, no water. There's gotta be water around here someplace. I can't actually see... Oh no, if we die of thirst, I will be really upset. Um, yeah, I don't want that to happen. I want to see, where is the rest of the swamp? We've got to come over here. Back here is the freshwater swamp, right? There's also a juvenile Dakota Raptor. This had better be freshwater or I will be really upset. Okay, it's freshwater. We're good. All right, let's go ahead and we'll get a drink and maybe we'll fight that other Dakota Raptor off. And because uh, he's, I think, a juvenile, but we're not going to tolerate him. We are going to take him down. And did we get him? We got him. All right, we got him once. We've got him almost twice. Oh, not quite. He's on the run. All right. He's running away from us. And we got him. Oh, we got him again and again. And, well... Survival of the fittest. Take what you can get <laughs> in the wild. Um, it's not pretty, but we gotta live. And so we're gonna go ahead and settle down over here once again to wrap up the episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. But until then, this is Jay, over and out.